Does your iPhone 17, 17 Pro or Pro Max say call failed when you try to make a call or it keeps showing call ended repeatedly, then it may not be your iPhone that's causing this. So let's try some easy steps and fix it in minutes. Right off the bat what you gotta do is bring down the control center, toggle on airplane mode, wait a few seconds and toggle it back off. Also, if you still can't place any calls, then make sure you also have an active plan. Next, let's give our iPhone a refresh by force restarting it. To do this, press the volume up button, then quickly the volume down, and then quickly hold down the side button. Keep holding until you see the Apple logo. This will restart your iPhone's network connectivity and may as well fix it. Still having the same problem, then try turning on Wi-Fi calling and see if that works for you. To do this, open settings, scroll all the way down, tap on apps, find phone and open it, scroll down, tap on Wi-Fi calling, choose the SIMs that show up here and toggle on Wi-Fi calling. This will help you make a call even if you have low coverage. If the problem persists, then if you have a physical SIM, it's a good time to take it out, give it a good wipe, along with cleaning the SIM port, then reinsert it properly. And if you have an eSIM, then you can remove the eSIM and add it back. Just make sure you have the QR or activation code. If you're still getting call failed, then this may be your SIM card that's not working. So try a different SIM card or number and see if you can place calls. If that works, then you need to replace your SIM. But in case you can't make call, no matter which number you're using, then what you can try is resetting your phone's network settings. To do that, go to general, scroll all the way down to transfer or reset iPhone, tap on reset, and choose reset network settings. In some cases, reset all settings can also work. Note that resetting network settings will disconnect you from Wi-Fi, so make sure you have the Wi-Fi password handy. Hopefully this will fix the call failed issue. If not, then first check if you have any iOS update pending. If don't, then you can run a diagnostics on your iPhone on your own and figure out what the issue is. If you want to do this, then shut down your iPhone, have the charger ready in your hand, press and hold both the volume buttons and plug in the charging cable while holding it. Now your phone will turn on into diagnostics and repair. So tap on continue, connect your Wi-Fi, press agree and select run diagnostics. Now choose the first option called mobile resource inspector. Tap start diagnostics, then wait a couple minutes to let it finish. Now you'll be able to see whether your iPhone has any issues with cellular or eSIM and if you don't see any issues, then you can contact your carrier. And to exit out of diagnostics, just tap on these three dots, exit diagnostics and then tap on exit. But if it does return an error, then you can either contact Apple support using the support app or take your iPhone for repairs. And that's all. Hope this helped you out and I'll see you in the next one.